help is as I'm nice. Um, not good enough. I don't, I don't have um, any kind of passion. That, man? I don't have any motivation to come here anymore. Um, I can't, I, today, like, I wasn't looking forward to coming to the game. I mean, it's, it's, it's just, it, it comes down to starting lineups um, every single week. It's just controversial, unneeded. Well, all the fans can see what starting lineup we want, and you can put us out the most controversial, one, one of the worst lineups, and most controversial lineups I've seen from Pellegrini. And um, it just makes you question, like his his thought process, like why you're dropping up one of our, one of our best performers this season in Fredericks, like. First of all, what kind of a decision is that? It's awful. I mean, you bring on Zabaleta, who every time he's played this season, been done nothing, been slow, poor. I mean, don't get me wrong, he wasn't awful today, but Fredericks would have done a lot more. He would have got drove into the box, you know, offered a bit more going forward, you know, and he didn't. And, and dropping on Bonner, who also has probably been, been been our best defender this season, and you know, I don't, you know, I don't think he's a great player, Bonner, but this season, I mean, he's been our best defender. I mean, Diop's been sloppy at times, Cresswell and Maswaku, both shit. I mean, Nogbonner's been the only kind of stand-up performer who surprised me this season, and you drop him. Pathetic. And also, you got... Who else, who else you drop? Um, Fornells, Lanzini. All right, for, yeah. Damn so fair enough. Um, and Snodgrass, yeah. I mean, Snodgrass being brought in. I was, I was kind of... Should have been brought in or not, because I, I doubt, it, doubt his play. But centrally, yeah, being pen, played centrally today was probably the best decision, because he played all right. And then, and then with dementia, because I think he's got it, you know, he brings him off. Pathetic. It's the worst. It's like Some of his substitutions and that is just awful. Eight million pound a year. Is he worth it? Who? Oh. Greeny. Oh, no. You know, you know what? I love the guy and I think he's a good manager. But there are times where I question his like, kind of ability to just make stupid decisions. I mean, is he, is he any better than Moyes, really? I mean, Moyes made the same stupid lineups and stupid tactics and stupid substitutions every single game. Is he much better than him? If Moyes had, you know, if Moyes had this team... Oh. If Moyes had this team, you know, he'd probably be doing the exact same. So really, I think we need to kick up the arse and maybe a new manager. I'd love... I mean, you look at Leicester last night. Brendan Rodgers has got his team sorted out. 9-0. We would never win 9-0. He's got his team grounded in. They've got the tactics there. I mean, you don't look at individually, individually at their players and think, you know, they've got a much better team than us. I mean, probably on the same level, if not maybe our team's slightly worse. They attack with pace and intent. Exactly, and that's the exact difference. I mean... Pellegrini doesn't give his our players a kick up the arse. Anderson loves to fiddle about a bit. I mean, I didn't think he played too bad today, but in other games where he just likes to fiddle about with it outside of the box, he doesn't like to cross the ball in. He, he tries playing his shitty tactics and he's got no interest in kind of driving forward. And like, his positional play is awful, Anderson, as well. He doesn't like making any runs. And then Jan Malenko, he's like on and off. He's hot and cold. Like stayed if he had a great game either. Um, and Lanzini, like when Lanzini and Fornells come on, their position, their positional awareness is awful. Like they like to stand behind players. They don't like to come towards the ball and drop and drive. Like, the old Lanzini used to get the ball, pick it up, and run towards the fences and strikers. And now, now look at him. He's, he's dropped a whole level. And I don't know what's going on with Lanzini. And Fornells, he's just, he's just shit. I don't even know what's going on. I'm sorry to cut you off early, but I am getting fucking soaked. But thank you very much, mate. I appreciate it. Cheers. Thank you.